You know, the biggest, uh, the, the biggest acting hurdle that is going to consistently happen in your careers as actors is this. Anticipation or non-anticipation, right? When it's done well, but anticipation. Because why? Well, because I know what's coming. I've rehearsed this thing. I've read the script so many times. We've been in rehearsals. We've drilled it forwards and backwards, etc. And yet here it is, the door knocks, and I'm supposed to have this organic surprise that, you know, that the, that the baby's dying or that you're leaving me or that, you know, whatever that news is, right? It's, it's constant. It's the number one acting hurdle, the most consistent one, is, is to not anticipate what's coming, be it the line, the dialogue, the situation, the moment, right? That's, that's what it is. And that's one of the many brilliant things about this training, because I don't know any other way. You are trained to be so present, so out of this thing and present, and not peeking ahead, and not working from your head, and not trying to steer it or anticipate what's coming. I don't know any other way to have an organic, truthful response to receiving news, whatever that news might be. So. Again, one of the many uh, genius byproducts of, of what Sanford Meisner has created is because, again, when you go through this training, you are these pr present, moment-to-moment, -moment, instinctive, organic machines. And if you are, if you really are, if you're really present, that's why that first foundation exercise that's what it's all about, to, be, to begin the Meisner technique. But it's not what the Meisner technique is. The repetition exercise is just the beginning so that we can put the rest of that foundation in place. But what, of a, hell, what a hell of a foundation. Because that first three months of that drilling of that repetition exercise, oh my goodness, it's all about getting you, again, so present. So that this becomes habit. This is how you, you work. You are a world-class listener. I don't know any other way, you know, to have, to be able to, to not anticipate and to react truthfully under these imaginary circumstances to whatever's coming at you. So, anyway. Here we go. Let's work on that.